We need more women in technology. Now, uh, one of the ways you get women into techn technology is they have a passion for it. Uh, they have a passion for building neat new things, or they have a passion for consulting with people to get them to be successful in business or something like that. Well, I'm going to talk about how I developed a passion for engineering. So this is Donna's story. Now, when I got to, uh, and I really wanted to be a, um, a, a pilot all the way up until I was about 10, and then I discovered that aeronautical engineers were people who built airplanes. And I just was in love with airplanes. I had model airplanes on my ceiling and all that. And so uh, I said, OK, I want to be an aeronautical engineer when I was 10 years old. And then when I was 12, I started reading science fiction. By the time I got to college, I walked into my advisor's office. And he said, in 1958, he says, what are you doing here? And I said, I'm here to major in engineering. And he said, girls can't be engineers. And I said, yes, I can. So by 1961, here I am. And there were actually four or five women in the School of Engineering. I was the only woman in aerospace engineering, aeronautical engineering. And uh, how many people know what the thing in my hands is? A slide rule, right. For you younger people, that's a non-electronic calculator. 